very warm welcome for those watching the replay version of this absolute first look at expert i only played this course already on stream in rookie and pro no practice tokens spent prior to that so a true first look i'm not playing to qualify so you will see me dot through the scorecard not playing this account through beyond today so i don't think it's fair to take up a position in the leaderboard and bear in mind these are first looks only so we're going to try some stuff out may work it may not please hit thumbs up on the uh, video make sure you're subscribed if you are watching the replay version timestamps for each hole in the description down below we're going to take a look at hole number one okay so it is send it then there's a send it job okay let's have a little look right then where are we Uh, shout out also to the guys working on uh, Tommy's guides. My colleagues, Radu, Brandon, they're spending the tokens, as will be Tommy and Mark and Paul up in Master. Link to those, uh, patreon.com forward slash golf clash Tommy, if you do want to get those. Um, they will be out. And the changes to expert as well, going to be out sooner than before. Um, so if you're ever worried about time, uh, to play your rounds, then don't worry about that. The, the guides are going to be coming up, um, being re released early. Uh, Brandon has done hole one and hole two here, so I may actually uh, have a go at a Brandon shot with this uh, Send It Wind uh, from his raw notes. See if we can get something here. He's just finished hole two as well. So uh, I may well have a look at that, see if we can get something going. Power five. Not had a look at the video yet though, so let's see if I can do it off the notes. And don't forget, go and subscribe as well. Uh, Brandon put some great expert content out. Um, and also, actually, wanted to mention, Inc we've all heard of Incognito, the clan. They have a YouTube channel now, so if you want to see some of the top players, uh, they were doing a grind stream yesterday in Tour 13. Brilliant Master Tournament players, so go and check out In Incognito on YouTube as well. They have a channel, and I think quite a few of their members are going to be streaming. I don't know how often. But there's one for the people that like that sort of thing. Right, let's see then. 8.3. A time out here actually. A little look at this Brandon shot. Let's see if we can replicate it properly. So this one already is going to be a must, isn't it? That's a nice shot. Uh, oh, stay on the fairway. Very well done. Very well done. Just having a look at Brandon's video here, actually, so that I don't mess up his instructions. Uh, so credit to Brandon on this one. 
Okay, yeah, it is. It's, um, okay. So it's NMT that he's doing here, 8.5, max plus 10, power 5. Then it's pushing back up to top of 24 with the APOC, 5 plus. And it's going to be max OP. Let's have a look. I'm following raw notes, so that's why I just had to check the video there. Okay, we uh, clipped the rub there. If that was intentional or not. Do we have an Embringer though? That's the thing. Going to be, there's going to be loads of ways to reach a green on that. I mean, the opponent did it for the Titan. Big Rob, how you doing? Well, I don't know if we're in Embringer range, actually. Did I forget some curl there? Oh, am I going to actually be able to play a shot here? No, because I timed out. Easy eagle, then. Easy eagle. Let's just have a look here what happened there. 11. Perfect away. Okay, yep, so Brandon's clipped the rough and rolled out as well. And his raw notes, they do mention Embring a school plus 20 from there, so it, it would have been fine. But obviously, uh, you could get a bit nearer, really. I don't know. Easy eagle, though. Titan, though. Opponent went with a Titan. So, again, many ways to uh, skin a cat. Let's have a look on hold two. Yuck. <laughs> Not the best wind in the world. I might have a go at the rough bump here. Rough bump or rocket is an option. Let's put the rocket in. Obviously, we're going to have to go with the Kingmaker. Okay, let's go. Let's have a look. When you're getting ready to time out, change balls so you can save a Zerg. Uh, it's not costing me a Zerg if I time out. It's only if you hit the ball that it will um, be a problem. Thankfully. Otherwise, I'd be rapidly depleted. Rapidly depleted in supplies. Okay, come on, opponent, please, on hold two. Would be nice. Right, so where are we going here then? Have we got a shot with the rocket? I wonder if that's worth a go. Have I got room to adjust? Maybe, maybe not. What we got with the QB? I may give the rough bump a stab and leave it a bit high. Going to time out, obviously, and then um, we've got room to adjust that, of course, which is okay. Eagles Elite, how you doing? Thank you for the good luck. Uh, 
Brandon has an NMT with the quarterback. Uh, I'm going to have a look at a rough bump. I'm also going to have a look at um, a win five rough bump as well as an alternate option. That'll be later on today. Nine point one. I kind of wanted lower wind, really. <laughs> I'm not going to be putting a king slayer on, not for a first look. Right. Let's see if we can have a go with a rough bump and a king maker. If not, it's obviously it's going to be a bounce bounce over. Not too dissimilar to what this guy's doing, actually. That's that's going to come in, well, fairly close. JJ, thank you so much. After 2 a.m., yeah, enjoy. Get some sleep. Thank you for being here. 8.2 is not bad. Let's uh, let's have a first go at the rough bump. First attempt at the rough bump. We're going to leave the ball guide a bit high. Uh, mid plus 15 is going to be my first effort, which is 8.4. No idea if this is any good, so we just give it a go, see if we can get perfect, and we test from there. Perfect ball, GC only, how you doing buddy? Long time no see. We have contacted the rough, but we've lost too much distance there, so need more on that. But we tested with a perfect, and that's all you can really hope to do. So work on that a bit later. Wind five. Should be a good attempt there, really. Or a wind four, maybe. It wouldn't necessarily have to be a wind five with a rough bump. Good thing about rough bumps, take out the secondary wind effect. So there's more chance you can use different power balls. Whereas bounce up shots, they could work with a wind three, may not necessarily work with a wind five and vice versa because the adjustment takes into account everything that happens with the wind. Oh my goodness me, that's awful. Dear me. Uh, well, the, the island is out then here. I'm not gonna get on the island at all. Not with that wind. That's going to be just a non-starter. So it's going to be a layup job. And see if we can get to wedge range. Uh, in which case I may as well put the sniper in because I don't think the big dog will reach from the left. So we're going to go rock, sniper. Or we're going to go not rocket. We're going to go... Uh, where are where are you? APOC. Could even play Thor's Hammer. Then we'll have the quarterback. Let's have just all the options available. Thank you for the good luck, Byron. Hope you're doing well. Thank you for popping in. Let's have a go with this one then. opponent please right we have an opponent let's see then the island is going to be off the menu here uh, so we're looking at a three shotter the other good the actually not saying it's a good thing but it's a tricky thing is with that island the front of it does have a slope so you can catch a weird bounce on that it's not like you're bouncing on a 
you know, like a flat pad, you know. Uh, Tommy will be doing, and he's probably got them up already, uh, he's doing Hull Guides for Master, so if you play Master, check out Tommy's channel there. Hull Guides uploaded throughout the day, news just in. A few glitchy rolls, yes. Let's see what we can do. No, if we're laying up, I'm kind of hoping I can just use the rock, to be honest. I'm not even going to attempt the island. Uh, where do I want to be then? just want to try and get, you know, it's going to be basically direct headwind for the second shot. Probably play with a bar of top spin because it's going to push us back, isn't it? 9.1, let's go mid plus 15. Just to give myself a bit more, 9.6. There's 9. There's about 0.6. Oh, mine a great ride. Shouldn't shouldn't bother me though with the rock. Needs a bit more adjustment though. I wasn't aiming that far back. Probably go maximum numbers really in headwind. Two ninety three. Let's see if we can get a sniper. And where we're likely to be. It'd be interesting to see this guy though with a cataclysm. Power slice works. Yeah, power slice is a good. Uh, Good option. Yeah, we're about 10, 15 yards short. But that's all tweakable. And like I said, it may be that we could, with a distance wood club, we could make it onto the green. I don't know. We'll find out. If not, we'll have a look at the layup. low ball here with a navigator so it's going to be interesting great as well bounced just made it through okay good reference point hefty slope on the green now i did i deliberately only packed the sniper on this so i mean we could we could we could blast that with a sniper couldn't we um could we go this way not really. Distance Wood Club really would be advised, I think, here. Strong wind again, like 9.1. Going to be pretty much full OP, isn't it? Let's just give it a blast. Perfect away. Okay, a bit more curl, but you can reach. So we're not going to have a problem with an eagle on that, which is good to know. But again, uh, we tweak the drive. That was a bit short. And then it's either going to be sniper with overpower, isn't it, or... For safety, you could go Cataclysm or Big Dog. So not as bad as I first feared that one. You know, when it when you first see the wind arrow, you think, oh no, no no no, that's okay. Okay, hole four next. Then uh, it's going to be rough bump, isn't it? I think. Yeah, I think you're going to find all of these par threes if you want to play aggressive apart from maybe hold two where a backspin will work four and eight is going to be uh four and seven rather it's going to be rough bump rough bump rough bump so fairway bounces are very very inconsistent 
Okay. Yeah, wouldn't want to be at the front of the green. No, I bet there's some uh, impossible putts on this course. Okay, hold four. See what we have. Rocket. Okay, I think we've got every possibility of club there. So let's go. Greens are very, very, very big. Yeah. Uh, the issue here, though, is uh, am I going to be in, like in between clubs with a power three or not? That's going to be the question here. This might be a timeout job. Come on. There we go. Don't forget, if you're watching on replay, thank you very much. Uh, join us on Facebook, totally free. BK Golf Clash Facebook group. Plenty of shot sharing going on. Help available from players in all level of the games. And don't forget, if you want to become a channel member, you can do so as well. Bonus expert content to be posted there throughout the week. What balls he got? Oh, it's the flamingo. Power one. Okay. Not seen one of these uh, flamingo balls in action yet. Pro division is up on the channel now as well. If you're playing pro, want to use the time stamps. Replays up there. Easy to navigate chapters. There you go. Right. Oh, we can do rough bump. Okay. 9.1. No, I don't want max wind. Give me low wind. Let's have a look. What do we do with this? I'm not going to play. I'm in a timeout. So we're going to adjust to a lower point. Okay. Right. Sam Pritchard with the emojis. Yeah, don't forget you get the emojis with uh, being a member as well. Make use of them. Right, time out. Hopefully I'm not going to get 9.1 again. Seems to be uh, quite high wind strength. No, oh, speedboat. I've not seen that one before. Okay. Come on, lower wind, please. 8.8. .8. Oh, thank you so much. How generous. 0.3 less. Right, let's give it a go. I'm going to aim quite high here and just see if I then don't need to do the push up or the, oh, okay. Uh, let's try it there, mid plus 10 for want of anything better, 8.6. I might try a little bit of a 1201. Yeah, we'll see. Oh, great left. Okay, well, let's see where we bounce then. Okay, we did contact the rough. 
a great left you would expect to miss more left than that so it could well need a bit more I went a bit less on the adjust I went mid 10 could be mid plus five that's not too bad though favored 1201 and still bounced in the rough even with a great so that's okay right hole five uh, is oh the double bounce job isn't it let's see if I can actually execute this double bounce and see if we can still play with the sniper on this one I think we should be able to on eight you can go over the uh, trees for the green oh okay I might might actually put a token on for that one then Nick Grego good to see you hope you're well thank you for the good luck right let's put the dot in on number four four holes five holes to go taking a while to find an opponent though we have one Right, so we want to do the double bounce then. Let's see if we can actually get this. Let's go in. Let's try that. Max plus 10. Six rings. Plus 10 with APOC 6, so you could could do this with an APOC 4, in theory, if it's any good. Let's have a first go, see what happens. Perfect away. Roll, please. Ah, just a smidgen short. Okay, that's useful, though. Just set up a little bit further on. That's not far off. Gonna obviously chip out like we've done before. Have a look at the second shot, see if we can get it with a sniper. Opponent trying a Titan here, so that potential that this will work nicely. Be nice to know that an APOC 4 will be fine there, really. Obviously has two clicks less top spin, but should still make it. Because adjusting there, you do go off the fairway slightly, so it could lose a little bit of distance on the shot. Not far off though, that's kind of my best effort on that hole. Rookie was, was good, of course, but into pro we is a great, so that's a nice one. That's pretty much what I wanted to do, really. So let's chip out to where we need to be. Really weren't far off. I think, you know, there's probably good. See if we can do something with the sniper. If not, it will have to be Distance Wood Club or Horizon. And don't forget, you get on Facebook as well, totally free. Uh, you get the wind charts posted there late morning. And uh, thanks to everyone who does prepare those. We do post them as soon as we get them. So join us, exclamation mark group, over 9,000 members. Right, he's had a good attempt with the sniper, and we can have a good look too. Crosswind, we'll need a bit, well, we've got a bit of tailwind. Let's leave it a touch short. Plus three. 
plus two, that's ten. Seventy-five slider and cross window, so maybe a bit more. Nine point three, nine point six. Go mid. Uh, sorry, seventy-five slider, fifteen elevation, nine point six. See where we go with that. Generous nine point six. Perfect away. I nearly went 20%. Let's see if I should have gone with that. No, should have gone with 10% really. 9.3 would have been better. So true club plus 10. Use the plus yardage on that. That's a good chance really. I think that's going to be a good, a good go. Right, hole six, what you got for me? Okay. I'm just wondering about the horizon here for the second shot. I'm gonna give this a go. because of the ball guide and let's just see if we can get um, into range for that I mean I do have a rise in seven which is going to obviously help I may set up with the rock and and go with uh, could do a club switch though as well actually went with the expert playthrough you put up for the spring break and took home silver medal thank you yeah we've got some great content for the mini and a lot of people getting banners with the uh, free videos so well done here's a boom there you go a bit delayed but we got there i didn't have it that long on saturday either but we got some stuff that was tweakable as well which is always good you know had to go and do my day job as it were right then what have we got here crosswind Jason, how are you doing? It is a tough one. Very enjoyable, though. Like a tough puzzle that needs solving. Okay, what's he done? He's gone directly over there. That's not bad. If it parks up, sit, sit, sit. Oh, hey, look at that. Pushing it to the limits there. Let's see what we can do. More of an angle, though, from back T. Five bars of top spin with the rock nine, of course. Again, it will need the curl. Let's try and push it a bit more. Mid plus 10. Uh, not 75%. Well, I've got that still there. 5.4. Let's go with a ball of curl and see what happens. Oh, great. And it may not be good. Actually, it's helped us out. A perfect would have been close to the rough. So more curl needed. More curl needed on that one. Let's 
probably going to be one of those where we could use a quarterback to find the position and do a club switch. Very useful to do that when you're not in plus yardage and with different levels of APOC having different accuracies. Very helpful. Because everybody's got QB9 or above in expert. Right, let me see. Do I have the horizon in Clash Caddy? No. So let's get that remedied for a start. I may chip forward a bit to replicate a tweaked drive. I don't know. Obviously, if this goes in, I'll have to play. Oh, okay. Yeah, very short. So I'm going to chip forward to where I want it to be. Could definitely go with a bit more top spin. So let's try and put ourselves center fairway. Should be obviously the ideal position. We don't want to try and get towards the rough too much. We want to be having room for error. And don't forget, members will get bonus expert content as I create aggressive options, special ball options. Uh, we do create individual guide videos for those. So if you are a member, you will get access to those as well. And a member only archive, over 100 videos in that. Bloopers, vlogs, other stuff as well. Right, let's have a go with the horizon then. Gonna try this one max plus zero four rings and then see what happens. Do you need it perfect though? We do, let's have a look. Good ball guide on the horizon, of course, which is why it's a nice option. Oh, close. That's a good opportunity, that. MJ, best value GC channel membership by far. No offence to others, but it's just bad. <laughs> Decent look on hole six. Let's have a look at seven. Oh, yeah, okay, it's this nasty one again. And again, just going to switch out everything here so that we can, if we need to find minimum distance lines, then we can. When I get the right clubs, come on, sort your stuff out here. QB. There we go. Right, hole number seven. I like the horizon there, you know. Push the drive a bit further. Lower level horizon has a few few yards less, though, I think. So that's obviously something to consider. But you could still have a crack with the um, with the big dog or the cataclysm. You can always tell the audience are making notes. It's lovely to have a, a really true first look at these holes as well. Because uh, don't forget, I've not played any of this. I didn't have time. I was busy with the mini, and then you know work got in the way. Sun, sunny weather outside to top up the vitamin D levels we got here then okay time for some food in three holes time as well I'm quite uh, peckish now 11 more thumbs up away from 100. Can we get there before the end of the stream? Over 100 in as well. Thank you all for being here. This little first foray into the Old Bridge Park. And again, a reminder for those who just joined, I'm not qualifying any of these accounts this morning. I'm not playing them through to the rest of the week. I'll use another account for the expert options and rookie and pro I'm not playing due to work. And I don't feel it's fair for me to take a spot when I'm not going to progress in the for the 
opening round and all of that. So that is why we are forfeiting or throwing puts. Oh, 9.1 again. Stop giving me this horrendous win, please. not a bad spot. I'm going to time out. Bit of a weird spin amount though really. It's not, not ideal is it? That, that might be better. What's that? One and a half and two. That's easy to remember. Yeah, you know, there's loads of stuff out there. Um, you just need to find what suits your play style, what suits your balls and equipment and all of that. Because what might be an easy shot for somebody will be more difficult for somebody else. And so on. 9.1. Ugh. I'm still not putting a win four ball on there. I mean, that seems to be a, a fairly decent spot to land. Doesn't seem to glitch around, so let's go mid 10 power three, 9.2, or should we just go one on one? I don't know. Might do a bit of an 11.59. I'm going mid plus 10 and see if we can hit a perfect ball and see where it lands. Perfect away. Hits the rough very low for a start and missed left. Okay. Interesting. I think that landing spot was good though. It, it doesn't seem to glitch around. Um, it need to correct falling to a lower point a lot more though. Like I said, we hit the rough quite far back. Okay, number eight. Uh, this was the blast it one. Okay, I might um, I might try and blast a token out here then. Just one shot, and then we'll do one layup. Don't really want to use a win zero. We'll see. Let's let's try a token. I will splash out with a token for you uh, people here, and the replay viewers as well. Let's just give it a go. Um, as Nick said, you need apoc six, probably a win zero. If we have high wind with a berserker, it might be might be good. Um, if not, I might whack a globe on and just. Just see if we can get a perfect ball away or a minor grate or something. I don't know. Send it. Yeah, we're going to send it. Didn't see what wind he had. Was it high or low? Go figure. We we'll probably may have high wind on the par threes and then low for this one where we want actually to send it. Okay, just a bit short with a Zerg. What have we got? 10.4. treat you to a globe. Uh, 
I almost hit the tree though. I'm just going to go for a fixed aim and see what happens. Be about 10 rings, so there. Minor great right, let's see. Oh, I've clipped something there. Okay, so we need to find a route through the trees. Maybe could have gone more right there. Okay. Okay, now we're going to go, obviously, safe option. That's, uh, I, I reckon I can work out something very good on that, actually. Let's go. I'm wondering if a hook might work as well. Uh, might be worth a go later. Nice mixture of wins so far. We will try and have as many options available. There could be some people that don't want to play the send it. And if it's possible to dial in the Grizzly, then that'll be a very good opportunity as well. It's a good route to the green with the long iron that we found in pro and rookie. We dropped it in rookie, very close in pro. I may have to go back and look at the replay and just find out which tree I hit if possible. Right, 9.9, .9. let's see where he goes with 9.9. .9. Come on, perfect, please. Muted? I'm not muted. Oh, you mean the chat? Just, okay, well that's worth keeping in mind, 9.9. .9. Got over there. What's our other option here? Yeah, occasional glitch roll potential though here, so that's not something we want. Let's try that, max plus 10. We need too much curl though, 8.1. Just in the, in the wall. Ugh, great ball, God. Uh, it's showing up as fine for me, Jason. It may be your settings, but of course that's no good because you can't hear me. I presume everyone else can hear me because usually if people can't, everybody will be saying in chat they can't hear me. I'll type at you instead. Yep, so we're fine. Check your settings. I need, I need to do sign language. Well, I don't know any. Five more thumbs up to 100. Don't need audio for that one. There it is on the screen. Can we get the last five? Can we get the last five. Let's have a go with the Grizzly. And we, we know that a Berserker can make it out with low wind. So that's uh, useful to know as well. We've got plus yardage. Good. Plus five. Try and play true distance. We are... Four yards from max, so that's 82, sorry, 92. Slider will go plus 10, 9.4, see what happens. Perfect away. We've gone true club 10%, see if it's any good. Ooh! Okay. 
did a bit of a 360, but it's okay. Oh, please say I don't want to, mind you, I'm not going to use this account anyway. I don't want to qualify them. Nice. Okay, so true cut distance 10%. Obviously a minor, minor great on the drive, but not going to be... Uh, it was with the rock, you know, you're still going to have a good chance with the Grizzly playing um, there. Ball guide slightly short of pin and uh, four yards away from max. So 2% slider per yard, 92%, 10% elevation. Golf Clash is in the house. Boom worthy. Thank you for joining us. And I'm sure plenty of the viewers here will join me in their excitement and their appreciation at the upcoming feature ball sorting we're excited right hole nine final one let's have a look here then this might be worth a might be worth a blast okay okay distance wood club needed here can obviously do what we've done previously and have absolutely everything possible in the bag and see if we can get onto the island with either a kingmaker or a power five. I prefer a kingmaker. Keep the wind low. Let's go. Let's go. Final one. And don't forget replays for rookie with true rookie clubs up on the channel already. Replays for pro up on the channel already. And if you're playing expert and you want to go back and make more. Uh, detailed notes and tweaks or whatever from what we've done with our true first look because I've not played this course at all until today then the timestamps will be up with a replay version of this expert probably about 10 minutes from uh, the end of the stream 100 likes thank you very much any plans for a ball this week Eddie Cruffin's going in He's wanting the teasers. How we all find in the new course, let them know. I'm liking it myself. Challenging. Makes you think it's all good. Playing very nicely. Oh, look at this, going for a direct bounce on the uh, island. One oh eight and climbing is what we like. Not giving any spoilers away. Great shot. Oh, it's nice. Look at that. Oh, we're right in the centre of the island. Go on, get out. No. Right. Now for a less spectacular route. Can we get onto this island then? It's a decent second bounce, you say. I'm going to actually stick with the Thor's hammer. No, I'm not, because I haven't got it in my Clash Caddy. I'm going with APOC. Uh, what should we go? Mid plus 10? 5.8? Let's try that. Could we have used the rock? Perfect ball, come on. 50th season coming up. Where's that time gone? Oh, I've missed the rough again. God. Missed the rough again. I tell you what, you get a load of wind push from that uh, bounce over the island. I'd left about a ring as well. So we have to have the second bounce even further from the fairway. Bull sorting is the best thing since sliced bread. There you go.
You see Jones been rinsing the tokens. Yep, you need to on a new course. Same with the new pins as well. Very, very good way to get yourself familiarized with all of this. 50 seasons already, there you go, there you go. It started here, seen it here first. Something special for the 50th season, come on. Kai, and Ben, I long for the ball sorting news video when we get the full info. So do I. Keep your eye on the channel. As always, when I find out more on anything Golf Crash related, Going to be the first to know. Going to chip out to where I wanted to be with a better drive and then have a look at the second shot. Get the bell button enabled and we'll get your notifications. Did I pack the cataclysm? I think I did. I think I did. Oh, no. I got the wrong bag on. Let's see. We can probably still do this with a sniper. That's annoying. No, we want to land here. And that's seven rings on. 7.5. Oh, 7.7. 7. Just push up to max. I think it'll be the same. Seven rings on. I wanted the distance wood club there. I just put the wrong bag in there. It's all the excitement about the ball sorting. And uh, I had the cat, and I think I had the cataclysm in bag two as well. But it's going to be the same type of thing. We just go full curl. Have a bit more curl with the distance wood club, of course. There you go. We're on the green. It's it's the it's the right idea. Sadly, I just had the wrong <laughs> had the wrong clubs in the back. Too much excitement about bull sorting. There you go. So that completes our look at nine. And of course, I went second, so I couldn't forfeit. Um, I don't think a minus six is going to qualify. Um, but there we go. Going to end the recording for the people on replay. Thank you for watching.